Hey BC Nation, what is going on? It is Brad Chicken here, bringing you guys the TechIt tutorial video so that you guys can log on to the TechIt server whenever you would like, even when I'm not there, even when I'm there, anytime, all the time, you guys can log in if you just follow this tutorial step by step. Hopefully it'll lead you to a great and happy future in the TechIt server. So anyways, what you want to do is open your favorite browser. I prefer Firefox because, I don't know, I just like it. So then what you want to do is go to TechIt or technicpack.net as you can see right there You're gonna wanna click enter and then um, you can do a couple of things you can actually download the launcher to the technic pack you can download the jar to the technic pack so I'm just gonna download the jar you can download either so I'm just gonna download the jar so I can get it over with fast it's gonna download here in a second my downloads is freaking out because I've been on this computer heavy with gaming and stuff like that for a couple hours now about six because I was also streaming which also takes a lot of processing power so essentially there's no RAM in my computer left so that's why it's gonna take a while so I'm gonna do this I'm gonna run it and then it's going to come up with the actual tech at launcher as you can see here so yours is gonna look fairly similar to this it's gonna be exactly the same and what you wanna do is you want to it's gonna start off on um, something else most likely what you wanna do is go to the tech it like that and then you're going to want to go to the options you're not gonna log in right away you're just gonna to go to the options and it's going to be on always use recommended builds right here what you wanna do is set it to always use development builds boom just do that you're good to go I like to uh, put four gigs of memory on there even though you only need a minimum of one gig I'll do one gig for now so that my computer doesn't crash and freak out so essentially what you want to do is just select always use development build so that way you can actually get onto the server because the server is using the development build so do that memory to allocate you always need one gig or else it won't will not work the actual tech it launcher will not work then just press OK and so you're gonna log in just like normal Gonna log in, it's gonna restart, then log in, it's gonna check for updates, all that great stuff, and then it's gonna launch TechIt, which is essentially like a Minecraft copy except with a lot of mods already pre installed. So that's the only difference between Minecraft and TechIt. So as you can see, TechIt is launched instead of actually a Minecraft. So I'm gonna launch them both right now just so that I can do one thing. So here we have TechIt and we have the Minecraft launchers, both in their separate spots. So I'm going to log into Minecraft, and the only thing you need to do to get into the actual TechIt multiplayer is you need to go to multiplayer and pry, uh, and then create a server. It's going to be, well not your server, it's going to be Bread Chicken server. Then you're going to want to type in 72.51.43.74.27365, just like the uh, previous one, which is the vanilla server. So they're, they're exactly the same, all I have to do is switch either if the server is running on TechIt or if the server is running on vanilla and essentially they're the same IP everything is the same except for the gameplay of course so I'm just gonna hop into the actual TechIt server for just a second to show you some things that have been going on and then I'm gonna actually log that out, back out and start editing this video Anyways guys, that's about it for the TechIt server. All you gotta do is enter in the IP, download the TechIt jar, and boom, you are ready to play on the TechIt Minecraft server run by Brad Chicken, yours truly. Anyways guys, hope you have a nice day, hope you have a nice week. I'm Brad Chicken, see you guys next time.